a lot of all and no. Hello, my little friends. Today we have grammar time. We're going to learn how to use a lot of all and no to show quantities. Look at the grammar tables. He sells the eggs. He gets a lot of money. He does not work. He spends all his money. He has no eggs. Do you remember the fable in our story? What does Mark get after he sells the golden eggs? He gets a lot of money. What does Mark do with the money? He spends all the money. Does Mark have any eggs after he cuts open the goose? No, he has no eggs. Pay attention to the word "no" here, and the noun after it. We usually use plural countable nouns after "no." Now, let's look at the grammar tasks. Part A. Pinky wants to take a quiz about fables. Help her fill in the blanks with a lot of, all, or no. Look at fable number one. In the picture, we can see a bird. We call it a crow. This bird is going to get some water from the bottle. It wants to drink water. The bird is thirsty. It puts stones into the tall bottle. Then it can drink the water. Now look at fable number two. This boy is not good. He tells people there are wolves in the field, but there aren't any wolves. The boy. Always tells lies. One day he says, "Woof, woof." Villagers listen to him. Look at fable number three. The boy in the picture is trying to break the sticks. The father says to his children, "Help your brothers." It is easy to break one stick, but it is hard to break the sticks together. Look at fable number four. We can see an ant and a grasshopper. To store some food means you put away some food. So that you can come back and get it later. The ant is hardworking. It stores a food. The grasshopper only plays. In winter, the grasshopper has b food. Part B. Do you know these fables? Can you find some other fables? Okay, that's all for this video. Thank you and goodbye.